Hello. How are you? I'm trying to get the videos working. And of course, I get like a million notifications at the same time. Hi. Okay, there we are. We are live. We are live. Um, hi, William. Hi, Lily. How's everybody doing? Today, I am on three hours of sleep. Yes. <laughs> Preparing to go to um, Fort Wayne, Indiana, Pig and Pride. And I had to take my dog to the groomers. And they give us the appointment at the wee hours of the 9 o'clock in the morning. Anyway, welcome, welcome, welcome. Good, good morning. Good afternoon. <laughs> good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good morning. I think it looks extremely dark today, but I cannot help it. Um, today we're doing oracles. My name is Laura Gonzalez. For those who don't know, we do this coffee break videos Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And on Wednesday, we do oracles. And today we're going to work with Stacy the Marcos, Queen of the Moon Oracle. We're going to work with Celebration of Life Oracle. Celebration of Love, I'm sorry. Uh, we are going to work with uh, Don Miguel Reese, the Four Agreements Oracle. And also with the Spirit Animal Oracle. And those are the oracles for today. Um, I don't have a whole lot of announcements to do because I am not going to a whole lot of places other than for Wayne, Indiana. I'm going to be on Fort Wayne, Indiana, Pagan Pride. And um, we will be there sharing a couple of workshops and um, doing tarot readings as well, of course. And um, I will have my oils and spritz. So if you're in Fort Wayne, Indiana, come see me. Thank you, William. Good afternoon. He says the highlight of my afternoon. I love you, honey. You are definitely my number one fan, <laughs> and I love you for that. You're also my friend, and I thank you for that. All right, so Queen of the Moon Oracle, let's ask the divine for advice. Today, your advice is going to come more channeled than ever, because since I haven't slept, we have uh, one in Wayne and Gibbous Wisdom, card number 22. The card of wisdom and let's see what the message is did you know that when people are um, lack of sleep is like an ultra state of mind wisdom wisdom is more than mere knowledge there might be something you aren't seeing and need to research more thoroughly wisdom is gathered but it takes time learn from your experience you might wish to ask the opinion of a wise mentor if you are uncertain the affirmation is, I use my knowledge and experience to make wise decisions. I'll read again. Wisdom is more than mere knowledge. There may be something you are not seeing and need to research more thoroughly. Wisdom is gather, but it takes time. Uh, but it takes time. Learn from your experience. You might wish to ask the opinion of a mentor if you are uncertain. So there you have it. That is the card for the Queen of the Moon Oracle. Now let's see what the celebration of life has for us. And again, since I'm half asleep, I'm just going to pull one card. Strength, the golden path. Strength the golden path and let's see what's the message from strength you are being inspired to forgive a relative for a past hurt the relative might still be alive or have passed on regardless call this person into your inner temple and have a heartfelt dialogue with them and forgive them remember to ask their forgiveness for your part in this situation and give thanks 
You are being inspired to forgive a relative for a past hurt. The relative might still be alive or have passed on. Regardless, call this person into your inner temple and have a heartfelt dialogue with them and forgive them. Remember to ask their forgiveness for your part on this situation and give thanks. All right. And let's see what the four agreements have for us. I feel that I'm going super fast. I am not. It's just that I'm so sleepy. I slept like two hours, maybe. I'm going to take a nap. All right. Um, oops. Dropping the phone here. Okay. The four agreements say, don't make assumptions. Be aware of unconscious assumptions. Assumptions are made so fast and unconsciously most of the time because we have agreements to communicate this way. We have agreed that it is not safe to ask questions. We have agreed that if people love us, they should know what we want or how we feel. Again, with asking questions. Assumptions are made so fast and unconsciously most of the time because we have agreements to communicate this way. We have agreed that it is not safe to ask questions. We have agreed that if people love us, they should know what we want or how we feel. So beware of unconscious assumptions. I will say, of course, in a nutshell, ask. Don't assume. Ask. That is something that I have learned from this for agreements thing. The not assuming but asking the questions. And last but not least, we have the um, Spirit Animal Oracle. I wish it was called something different, but I didn't name it. Um, and I don't know if the author is a native person or not. But that's why I always pause. The Spirit Animal Oracle. Appropriation is the same, folks. All right. Let's see what the divine in the form of an animal. <laughs> we have the bad spirit. Every birth is assured. Oh my God, this card is so funny. Every birth is assured. You know the video don't gives don't give justice to the beauty of the of the card. It's so beautiful. All right, so this is number five. Three, four, five. Okay, um, after something has run its course and died of or being released, finished, surrender, completed, or ended, there is a promise of a new beginning. Revert is assured, just as night gives way to dawn and the bat emerges from the darkness as a of a womb like cape. Bad spirit has come to remind you that this revert is a miraculous one for the very best elements of what you had to give up and the death of the old are still present in the new. Amazing life forming now. This is a miracle of magic and rebirth in every aspect of your life, including the rebirth of faith in your ability to establish new healthy relationships. And I repeat Oracle message, after something has run its course and died or been released, finished, surrender, completed, or ended, there is a promise of a new beginning. Rebirth is assured just as night gives way to dawn and the bat emerges from the darkness from a womb-like cave. Bat spirit has come to remind you that this rebirth is a miraculous one. For the very best elements of what you had to give up in the death of all are still present in the new. Amazing life forming now. This is the miracle of magic of rebirth in every aspect of your life, including the rebirth of faith in your ability to establish new and healthy relationships. There you have it, folks. Uh, for oracles for today, I hope this serve you and help you on your uh, middle of the week. And, of course, I will see you Friday with uh, the reading for the weekend. I will see you in Fort Wayne, Indiana, if you are around. 
And I will see you back on Tuesday here at Open House in Bridgeport in Chicago. And obviously, uh, Monday video and so on and so forth. But until then, you are loved. Never forget, my friends. You are loved. Bye-bye.